Hi, my name is Michal, but a lot of people call me Mickey, uh, Pearl, and I'm 23 years old. My name is Ilana Cohen, and I'm 24 years old, and I am from New Jersey, New York area. I'm Raz Bonifes. I'm 15 and a half years old now. I'm a CAT this year in Ultimate Peace. I grew up in Israel and moved with my family to New York City quite a while back, but I have a lot of close ties to Israel. I am a coach here. I was an assistant coach last year. Last year was my first year here, and I came back because it was such an incredible, such a powerful experience. I was a coach the last two summers, and I spent a couple of months living in Israel where I was also kind of a local coach going to communities, coaching at the hat tournaments. I've been playing for about three years. I first came in the, for the summer camp in 2010, and from then, I, every year, I've come and did the CAT project this year. I think the thing that is special about Ultimate Peace is that it lets people forget whoever they are, like age, uh, religion, place they live in, community, everything. And you're like in a place for one week, get to know each other, and you don't have to think about anything else. You get, you just get to know the people who they really are. So today was the first day of camp, which was really exciting. I was quite concerned because I had a girl on my team that I had last year that was a difficult camper, to say the least. She was not always very cooperative. She uh, only speaks Arabic, so once she realized I did not speak Arabic, she tried to kind of get her way out of participating a lot because she couldn't understand me as well. Um, so I was quite nervous to see how it was going to go down. The first day was a wonderful whirlwind. I knew what it was like because I, I did it last year, but now I was reminded and it was great <laughs> and it, it was tiring and just the way that we had a few hours with our team from the first time that we came together as a team, we were basically all undifferentiated faces, kind of looking at each other blankly, how will this become, who will these people be? And by the end of the day, not only did we know each other's names, but like, you know, what happened naturally was we would all come together and we would all just put our arms around each other. And she got here, she gave me a hug, she asked me what's up, and she was just so nice and well-behaved today and just excited and working with the rest of the girls. And that was really a relief, I guess, but also just really nice to see for her that, you know, she grew and matured so much in a year and she came here really excited and really wanting to be at camp this year. The CAT program, well, it's kind of a leadership program. I think it was the first time I actually had to do something like that, not by myself, but without any, without anybody above me telling me what to do. And I have to say it's pretty fun ordering people around. That's kind of not nice to say, but it's just cool. I have like authority, and everybody in the CATs have authority, something we never, we've never had before. What I think was one of the coolest things today was that during the team building time, a lot of teams got to choose a team name and make up a cheer for themselves. And then when we made it to our dinner tables where every team sits together with the team itself, um, it was like the biggest ruckus and all the teams were cheering one another and making their own cheers and, you know, doing all these like spirit cheers from one table to the next. And it was really like the vibe in there was really great. Today for the evening activity, there was a chunk of time where each team went together to different stations um, that was led by one person and in each station there was sort of like a task or a challenge for the team to complete together as a team and it, you know it encouraged teamwork working together communication getting more comfortable with each other so it was really cool to see the way each team kind of approached it differently and the different energies of each team like some of them were really like yeah let's go and others were like hmm I think this is an idea and there were just there was just a lot of personality shown, and it's only going to grow throughout the week. I think the reason that I keep coming here is simply because, okay, I came here the first year, made bunches of new friends. I'm like, come on, I need to see them again. It can't just end like that. Ultimate Peace is like a time that gives me, in, like, in such a short amount of time, I end up feeling like, yeah, this is real great so many times like in a short period of time whereas in regular life i might feel that way like once every couple of months but this week of ultimate peace it's like it happens multiple times a day and that's like a surge